Welcome back to Construction Simulator for episode 13 with me, Mr. Sealy P, licensed to drill, or maybe not. Carrying on from the last episode, we have got a bridge to build. I'm going to be Mr. Bridger. Uh, we've got to speak with the tourism officer, who I think is down here. We have to drive around the, um, I say the bay outlet. That that's showing a bridge, uh, a road there, but we've got to make it. I'm assuming this is going to require a lot of concrete pouring, a lot of rebar. Um, what else are we going to need? Tons of metal work, I would imagine. Well, let's find out, shall we? So I might skip bits of this. Um, it depends what bits we're going to, you know, need to do and. I might show little snippets of pouring concrete and things like that. We'll, we'll see what we need. For some time now, I've had my eye on an abandoned part of this city that would be ideal for a holiday resort. It's far from the loud and stuffy inner city with a perfect view of the ocean on one side and a magnificent view of the city skyline on the other. Of course, we want to stand out with a perfect location and easy accessibility. This means that the construction of a direct and safe transport link across the water to the vacation resort is crucial. And that's where you come in. <laughs> okay. Wow. Perform drilling. We haven't done any drilling yet. This is going to be cool. Well, deliver construction materials. So we've got some stuff we need to get. But then what we can do, we can go in and we can order it. Oh no, actually we'd be better off if we took the vehicle there and then we can collect it. But drilling machinery, that's going to be impressive. Let's have a look and see what it's offering. Rotary drilling rig, nice. Can you tell I'm excited? We haven't used one of those before, so we get to... Uh, I suppose this is drilling for the concrete pylons, is it? Or is it going to be for... So it's going to be running off of there. I guess so. Oh, wow. And of course, look at the time. It's getting late. Right, I'm going to whiz over. Go and grab the building materials. I'm going to lease the drilling rig. Where did I leave the lorry up here? <laughs> and let's go and grab what we need. I'm assuming that's showing drilling, perform drilling, form drilling, and then is that a concrete pour in there as well? Probably. Let's do it. A few peculiar things have happened. I'm back on site. I had to spend some more money um, because I went to grab my low loader, which I left over at the steel uh, factory, but steel company in the last episode, and it was gone. I thought, oh, maybe I put it into storage. Not in storage, vanished completely. So I've bought this one. So I thought, you know what? Big old trailer. I can put bigger vehicles and machinery on it. I can put those long transport tray containers on it with my um, semi uh, or lorry cab. With the crane, I can then unhook wherever I need to. But of course, rather than it put all the stuff you first get at the front, so you can stay attached, it puts it at the back. So, new trailer, I've got them to build, uh, the building materials, and I've got the drilling rig. Uh, if you go into the instructions for the drilling rig, it starts off by saying, this is the most complicated piece of machinery you'll use in the game. It's like, oh, brilliant. Um, this requires the use of the drilling rig. Um, these pipes, I say pipes, come in sections. So we've got a cutting, I say a cutting head. This end goes first, attaches to the drill, drills down into the ground so it reaches the depth it needs to be at. Then you pull the hole out with the earth, get rid of the earth, shake that off, then you put the second section on, drill that down as well until you reach the correct depth, then we'll come back later on and we pour concrete, as far as I can tell. Um, using that is going to be interesting, let's just put it that way. So I'm going to start off by just unloading the building materials and then we'll, uh, yeah, we'll give us a go and see how we get on with the, um, the drilling rig, I'm not sure how well we're going to do with it, but... I'm sure it'll be, it'll be fine. 
<laughs> of course it will. What's the worst that could happen? It could be carnage, the same as usual when I do anything on this game. That one. It's going out a bit further over there, I think. Rotate it. Swing it back. Drop it down. Job jobbed. Uh, I think we're a bit further out to the rebar next, I suppose. Oh, okay. Lucky it's rebar and not anything. Ah, uh... <sighs> oh dear, nothing uh, breakable. And then we're on to the drill. <laughs> we shall see. I'll move this whole lot out of the way. Make it easy for moving that all around, I think. And there we go. Cool, do that, that, that. I was wondering, I was looking actually for a crane spot, because I've got my crane that I bought, whether we could put the crane up and then just use that, but I couldn't find a spot, and this up on the hill maybe. Which I suppose it could be, couldn't it? Come on, a little bit further back, come on. Why is it not reversing? There we go. Let's get you out of the way. This whole episode could just be me using the drilling rig. We'll have to go and get the concrete and maybe get that in. So we might just start off by getting the, the uh, foundations in place. I don't know. Right, that'll do there. Let's hop out. Oh no. <laughs> this is going to be a nightmare. Ah. Uh, Probably going to need to get in the. Uh... Why are we not moving? It's weird. What's going on? Oh, what was it in drive mode? Why is it in drive mode? Okay. Wait. Oh, wait. So we've got a hoist on one side of this, I believe. So let's swing around to there. Uh, it's the hoist. So I extend the tracks, I suppose I should redo that now. Just because uh, instructions, let's get that open. So we want, uh, I think it's the next one. Let's have a look. All go up and down, boom up and down, attach, detach, hook. So circle and nil one. Oh no, that does that. That's not what I'm going to do. Uh, up and down. It's a cable. Let's say all go attach, detach, hook. No. Lift, hook up and down. There we go. So to grab that first then. Which is going to mean swinging around a little bit, I guess. No, 
cover that tunnel a bit further. Right, that's the one we need first to take it. Swing around a little bit so we get it up right. Putting this alongside, are we? So that goes onto the hole, I think. <laughs> and then we attach with the auger. Again, I think. Is that right? <laughs> oh, man. Okay. So we move that. Do we? Okay, and then we lower that down. And then do that. Right, now we move to the auger. Is that right? I don't know. Uh, we need to put that into that mode. Uh, raise that up. No. Raise it. Not rotate it. Rotate left, right, rotary drill up and down. Left. There we go, right. Perfect. Bring that down. Is this, is this how it's supposed to be done? Mm -hmm. I think so. Connect drill pipe. Okay. Is that right? Am I in the right place or should I be in the same green? It's filling up with earth. We'd have to release it and then... Wow, okay. Now what? Do I detach it? I don't know. It's automatically attached. Oh, it has. So we pull that out, and we have to shake the earth off, apparently. Let's do that over there. So, right. Why is that not letting the earth off? It's supposed to. Um, <laughs> I'm sure it said rotate auger. Lift all up and down. Hang on, manual. I'm sure it said uh, auger indicator, that's fine. Go across one, activate auger, did that. Drill and shake out, right? When the auger is full, you must first shake it out to continue drilling. Pull the filled auger back up the ground with R up and then shake out the collected saw next to the hole by repeatedly pressing. Pressing R and R. Oh, okay. Really? Nope, that does that. Not pressing, that's not right. That's not doing anything either. It's not getting rid of it. It's just by the hole, where? Bear with me while I try and work this out. I'm thinking I need to do the next section and then do it. Because it's not... No, it's not showing now because I've just switched to drive mode, but... Something's amiss. Over to there. Uh, we need to... Pick up the second section, attach that, and then I'm assuming we've still got a bit of room on the auger, so maybe it, it's only when it's full it works, potentially. Oops, wrong way, keep doing that. Back up to about there. Let me attach the next section, is that right? So, so you can see maybe that'd be more helpful, wouldn't it? Then forward. Then lower that. 
black gets attached. Now we need to, okay, now we're in position, kind of. We need to switch back to that, back to that, that up. Why am I not? I've lost my rotation. Oh, okay. Hang on. Blimey, what a palaver. Now try? Connect drill pipe. And then go again, I take it. It's not rotating. go. So I'm assuming it'll be full of earth when we get to the point where it will automatically disconnect, which I'm assuming it has done. I still can't get that earth off. So what's wrong with that? That's done, isn't it? As far as I can tell. Is there going to be a really simple explanation to this? Extend tracks. No, no, no. Um, okay, well, I'll try on the next one. If it gets full, then maybe it'll give me the option to. I can't find anywhere it just says... Like, unload it or something, you know? Well, I'm going to switch back to that. I'm going to go and grab the next pipe. And we'll see if we can do that one. Uh, let's swing that round. I'll do the next pipe and then um, we'll see. <laughs> see what happens. We still seem to have a lot of earth on there. That's just moving there. That doesn't seem to want to do anything. <laughs> I know it's painful to watch, but it is the hardest piece of machinery to use. It does say that. Well, that was a game. <laughs> um, I thought I'd made an absolute... I mean, I have made an absolute mess over here. I don't know what happened. But in raising the drill bit, the all got up with all the dirt in it, and then taking it to one side, and you're supposed to shake it to get the dirt off. You know what the easiest way I found of doing it? When you pull the whole auger out the ground, and then turn it out of the way, reset the machine. If you reset the machine, the dirt goes off the auger. I tried to do it here, and the dirt piled up and it wouldn't allow me to sink the, the second stage any further. So I ended up going to get the backhoe so I could dig the earth out of the way so it would allow me to carry on sinking it down. Now if you look at the top left, it's saying the, the first two sections are done, the second two sections are done, we're at 75% in each hole, which only leaves, as far as I can tell, the pouring of the concrete. So I've grabbed this, the concrete mixer, I've got a full load of concrete. We'll see if we can put this in. I mean, I'm assuming this is gonna work. Again, this is, you know, this is a bit of a hit and hope. <laughs> swing that round. Uh, we'll swing the... Swing that round. Uh, what do we want to do? Shoot on off. There we go, swing around the back. 
Now we're looking. Are we over the hole? It's hard to tell, isn't it? Looks like it. Maybe we go forward just a tad. In case it over pours. Oh, blimey. Okay, well we can try from there, can't we? <laughs> I'm assuming this is going to be what we need to do. Uh, M. No. Pour. Perfect. And it's not filling up. What have I done wrong? That looks right to me. No? It's definitely not working, is it? Don't want to empty it. Pull on off, shoot on off. I miss it. It's definitely that icon for pouring. Top left, 75% so the last bit's got to be the pouring the concrete. That hasn't got to be done with one of the big old, uh, you know, the concrete pumps, surely. Um, drilling, 75%. I don't want to skip the task, but we're done, aren't we? Drill the designated positions on the construction site. <sighs> um, let's hop into here, go to manual. Let's go all the way across to there. So when we get to that bit, Screw in second drill pipe. When the required depth is reached, the pipe is automatically unhooked. Shake the collected saw in the auger again. After drill pipes have been screwed into the ground, they are filled with concrete. Change to a filled concrete mix or a concrete pump to fill the borehole. Open the concrete, concrete, open the contacts menu and start the concrete flow. I don't know what's going on. That's what I'm doing, aren't I? Oh, hang on, there we go. Just wasn't quite at the right position. Really? 100%. I was I was too precise. <laughs> can, if you can believe that, <laughs> for me, that's that's quite something. I had to be forward of it, so it was actually pouring to the side of it and not actually into it. Um, can't make it up, can you? Right. So this I know what it's of this one. Now, I think there's a big old slab pour to be done as well at some point. We've got the rebar and stuff there. Um, <laughs> well, no, well, I never. further do not want to disappear into that hole let's try that nope back a bit there we go a bit more We are done. Clear the marked area. Poor slab foundation. Oh, I can do that with this, can't I? Oh, that was the thing I meant to say. I haven't really been showing it. I've been um, using up my skill points. That was the thing I meant to say. If we go across our uh, profile and go to our skill points, that seems to, that's still very pixelated. I must be doing that. So what I did was I increased my good business sense so I get a good 
pay. Um, that's now maxed on this level anyway. So I should get good bonuses. Crane speed, I'd already done a bucket capacity, but what I've done is concrete viscosity. So it says you're a skilled concrete worker and know how to mix perfect concrete for smooth pouring without leaving any open spots. So what I'll do is next time I get them, I'm going to get more of those done. So what should happen, um, I'm going to do that again. And then we'll do that. Ah, uh, see, that works quite well, doesn't it? And I'll just uh, pull where I need to, I guess. There. Okay. Now we're looking 43%. Go to the other end. We might need to go and get some more concrete. So that's going to be the two pillars have gone down under the ground as the foundation. This will go on, and then I would imagine the section will go from there to here on the first bit. I don't know how we're going to do the span across there. That's going to be an interesting one, isn't it? We'll just have to see, won't we? I probably don't need that, um, the drill anymore, but it was a tricky one to use. I, I must admit, I was a bit puzzled for a couple of minutes, and I, it was just a case of that first one as well. This first hole, that's the other thing I was going to say, no, um, was that, um, this first one here, when I thought I was done and it gave me the option, it disconnected it and I went on to do the second hole and this first one didn't get to 75%, it was only on 59%. I hadn't pulled enough earth out so I had to actually push the auger much further down into the ground until I got 75%, until I got enough earth out. So that was the other thing I wasn't, I wasn't aware of. But there we go. So that way, so that way. I'll just moment. Might be at 71, yeah, I'm not going to have enough, am I? <laughs> and that's a bit, without getting the old concrete pump, I've got um, all that, the building materials are in the way. If I can get far enough over, we might be able to. If I can pour up to there. Come on, please be enough. <laughs> of course it's not. Ugh. Okay, I'm going to go and get some more concrete. Back in a minute! I didn't completely fill it this time, because I didn't think I would need to. Um, hopefully, this will be it. Nope. Not quite. I need to get right into that middle bit. Hmm. Will it give me enough? If I can get right up into here. I don't think it will, you know. I'm going to bump up there. Let's try it. 99. <laughs> you can't be kidding me. Oh, man. Do I need to come in from the other side? Probably. Can I reach? Oh, yeah, I've got a little bit over there. Look. She'll be right. Come on now. There we go. That should be alright, shouldn't it? That should be just what we need. There we go. Clear the marked area. Hang on. There we go. Uh, put that away. Oh, 110 grand. We'll take that. Whoa, what happened there? Whoa! Okay, it, it appears to have constructed all the other bits. I've now got to pour columns. Oh, okay, so now I'm going to need the uh, I'm going to need concrete pump, aren't I? Because I need to reach up into those columns. This is going to be a lot, isn't it? Um, right, the drill I don't need anymore. At least I don't think I need anymore. So we'll send the drill back. Uh, vehicle fleet. Where are we? The rotary drilling rig. What a piece of kit that is. Um return. That's going to cost me a little bit. But... No, okay, not too bad. 
that's gone. So I should have got a full load of concrete because I never thought about that. Right, I'm just wondering time-wise whether I've got time to get the pump and get these columns filled before I run out of time for the episode. So what I'll do is I'll check my timings. We'll sort our lease in the concrete pump. We'll get that over and placed. If I stick it right in the middle here, we should be able to reach both sets and then I might have to just go backwards and forwards with a concrete mixer and we'll go from there. But we are making progress and that's the main thing. Um, then I would imagine it's going to be metal work, bridge spanning, and I don't know, that's all going to work, but... I still haven't got a location here for a, the crane. Mind you, that being said, I'm not going to be able to, unless we build a section and we have to drive out on each set. I, mean, I don't know, I'm, I'm just kind of, I'm surmising what might be the case. Um, who knows, yeah. So I'll go, I'll, I'll double check that. What time is it now? Of course it is, ten past eight. It's getting late. Let's go to here, let's go into the vehicle dealer, enter. And let's get ourselves another one of the old uh, piumpy piumps. Uh, what do we want? The concrete piump. I'm going to go for the one I usually go for. Which one do I usually go for? I go for the Mac cab over, don't I normally? That's the one I've been using. That one. Because uh, it just fits, doesn't it, for what we're doing? Oh, yeah, that was the thing as well. You know, I said I'd, my thing had disappeared. I had a message. Uh, who messaged me earlier on to say that I'd, uh, I, at some point in the last episode, I accidentally sold my trailer, my low loader. I, I obviously clicked on something, and in whatever I was doing, didn't even notice, um, but I sold it. So that was genius move, wasn't it? <sighs> I'm just thinking, actually, should I try a different concrete pump? What was that? Probably not really. Could choose the MAN one just to be different, just to mix it up a little bit. There's the Scania, could use that one. That's the only one, isn't it? Pretty sure it's just those three. Let's filter and do I want to filter again? We're not as asphalting it. Uh, yeah, Scania, DAF. I mean, that really should be what I'm using. They're all the same price, aren't they? Oh no! Whoa, hang on a second. That's cheaper and that's cheaper. Is it, is it the reach less or something? Um, let's give it a go. So anyone might find out. Uh, I wonder if I can do that. It doesn't look showing. Uh, it looks all right. I can't see. Can't see what will be any different. Get it over there, shall we? Right, let's get it into position and then I'll check. It's going to start getting dark again. It's the last thing I need really, but... We stick it right in the middle. Slap bang in the middle here. <gasps> Mind this stuff. It's about right, isn't it? Do that. That. Okay, not that great, but and then we want to go to that.
Oh, this would be the outside there, don't I? Is that right? There we go, Greg's need to be doing into the, into the uh, not the middle, one of the columns around the outside. Okay, right, that's where I need to be at. So that's going to be the next step. That's actually perfectly positioned. I can do both sides from there, no worries at all. So I'm going to check on my timings, and then what I'll do is I'll get the concrete put in the back. I can start putting some in. Um, no, not that one. I want that one. And open the hopper. Hop out. What little bit of concrete I've got left in here, I'll put in, and then I'll have to uh, go and get the rest. Lights. Wow, okay, that that went a lot quicker than I thought it was going to. Are we stuck now? Um, oh, you've got to be kidding me. So, in pouring it, it finished and then the whole beam got... Let's reset it. Right. That's not good. Now it's it's had some kind of it's had some kind of meltdown. Well, that was wow. Okay, um, wasn't expecting that. Come on, please, work. The boom doesn't want to go at all, does it? Let's do that. So we can reset it completely. Nothing. Well, wow, what's going on here? I wonder if it's because the mixer's in the way. It's just had a bit of a fit. That's the first time I've experienced that. Okay. Angles. Oh, okay. It's all it was, I think. Just the concrete mix-up in the way. I've got to be careful now. Is it going to do the same thing again? Maybe I need to be a lot higher up, away from it, maybe. Did it even use any concrete? Yeah, I need to be just a lot higher up, I think. As long as it's green above it, I'll be all right. Let's swing around a little bit. It's a praying mantis. It's a bit scary, isn't it? How we're looking? Nope, way off. No, that's... Is that going to be too close? Let's try that. Hopefully it won't do it again. And that used everything all of a sudden. <sighs> I do declare. <laughs> How are we looking at this? I don't even got anything left in this, have we? <laughs> no. Right, more concrete.
I'm not going to lie, the concrete pour on this has been ridiculous. It's, um, I mean, it's awesome, don't get me wrong, it looks fantastic. Oh, hang on, it's doing that side, I didn't even notice that, look. It's doing that side too. How did I not even notice that? But it's doing the opposite. Um, 17 grand each load of concrete, and every time I've poured it and it's jumped up to the next section, it's caught the pipe. The only way to do it is with the, the concrete pump. There's no way you can do it any other way. But it just every time it does it, it bumps up so many levels. If you hold the concrete pump too high, it doesn't come up with the green thing and it won't unload. You put it down so the green thing appears, the green disc appears, and then when it fills, it bumps up and catches the pipe every single time. Um, so I'm having to reset um, each time. But every time I've been resetting, it's been catching the... Uh, been catching the cement mixer as well so we'll try it again it's just frustrating it I mean it's that I'm having to do it each time there we go so I need to the other side now and it looks like there's gonna be another stage as well so but even more concrete to pour so I, I, was, I thought oh maybe that'd be it now so that concrete's done, that one's now saying zero and the other one's saying two percent, so well, we can go a lot higher, but it's just a bit annoying, really. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> but it pays out a lot. I mean that's the thing, I suppose the contract pays out a huge amount, but actually mine might need to be set sideways on this one. Um we're spending a lot, so I suppose there's that. No. Let's get that so it goes green. Come on, see it's red. Mine not going green. We're too high. Hang on, that went green then. Fraction there. Watch it jump up again and catch... Oh, not again! Oh, it's because I've got the thing. Open the chute. <laughs> That's been the other thing as well. Every time I've done it, I keep forgetting. Once I reset it, the hopper needs to be reopened. And you watch me jump in this now and the concrete mix will be empty again. Not far off. It's going to be at least another load. At least. We'll get there. Come on, Neil. Please don't go to help. Are we stuck? We might be. Oh, man. Are we looking at the other side? Got so much. Actually, that side is that done? Not sure. We're definitely stuck. Right. Okay. Well, I'll see you again. It's still got more to pour, and I've got to get this pipe out. But it's not going to go, is it? No. We're stuck in the. Uh... Right, we're at pretty much the, the furthest extent this will go. The other pouring columns one has vanished. We seem to have... We seem to be there, I think. Um, <laughs> so let's pour this hopefully last bit. I'm hemorrhaging cash on concrete. Oh, that's all right. We needed that. <laughs> we needed that boost. We've advanced in player level and we've got a new skill point to play with. Okay, now we've got to clear the marked area. That shouldn't be too much of a problem. It took a while, but we got there. Um, 192 grand for that section. I mean, to be fair, I think we've probably spent that in concrete. So whilst, the, yeah, it does pay out 700 and something thousand for the entire job, it um, has cost us a bit. So what I'm going to do now is just...
double check something. Uh, bearing structure, beams, special component placement. Oh, we might need to get ourselves a mobile crane, you know. I was tipped to the wink on that. Mobile crane. Uh, so, I'm hoping then. Concrete bearing structure, crane work, road works, debriefing. We shouldn't need. <laughs> we shouldn't need the, the uh, concrete pump anymore. Fingers crossed on that. Uh, oh, I'm still in it. That's why I'm just thinking. Hang on, let me get rid of it. Because I'm still in the machine. Let's go to the vehicle fleet. There, concrete pump return. How much is going to cost me? I've had it for about ten days. Right, don't get rid of anything else by accident. Um, concrete mixer. Do we have any concrete left in here? But I have to say, I mean, I was to say all in a day's work, but it has been a, a while. Next episode will be the next phase. <laughs> Honestly, it's absolutely crazy. So we are going to need that. What about materials for the next stage? Shopping list. No materials needed. Oh, maybe it'll, I will have to just have to bring the mobile crane and there'll be stuff here to do. Maybe. Um, so what we'll do next episode, we'll sort out getting a mobile crane. We've got any concrete left in here. Let's sell some back. Yes, we have. We can make a little bit on this load. <laughs> Not a huge amount, but that is the end of this episode. I know I, I called it license to drill and I don't think I earned my license. I don't think I qualified at all. Have we still got another... Yeah, let's get that out of the way. Um, but we have got this stage done. This is probably going to be two or three episodes of the bridge build, I think. But we got there. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you have... Please give us a like. If you don't subscribe yet, please do. If you want to leave a comment, feel free. And if you want to share this video, then please be my guest. Whatever you should choose to do. Thanks for watching.